I have finally reached 1,000 subscribers. This video is incredibly late because I actually hit it on August 6th and right now it is August 22nd. But I'm actually already at 1.6 thousand subscribers, which is just absolutely crazy. Thank you all so much. It genuinely means a lot to me. But since I did hit a thousand subscribers, I decided to do a little Q&A as my 1,000 subscriber special. So if you don't know what a Q&A is, it basically stands for question and answer. So you guys just ask me a question and then I'll answer it. Pretty straightforward. So yeah, let's get straight into it. The first question is, what is the best fan art I've ever got? Now this is a great question, genuinely great question. So someone in my Discord server named Ghoul made me an incredible drawing. I'll put it right over there on the screen. It is absolutely incredible. I love it so much. It's also my Discord profile picture. But she also made another piece of fan art that basically um, includes me, Himi, and Nitro all in one. And it's right there. I haven't really gotten that much fan art, so if any of you guys are artists and want to draw fan art, join my Discord server and send it in. I would love having it. But the person that actually sent in this question also made a really funny piece of fan art on their phone of basically like my main recording group. It'll be right up there. It's, it's really funny. I really do like it. So thank you everyone that sent in fan art. It means a ton and join my Discord server. The next question is what is my favorite VR game other than Rec Room? I would have to say either Blade and Sorcery or um, Onward VR. Both of those games are incredibly fun. I'd say Onward is, I'd say more fun with friends because Blade and Sorcery, you can't have multiplayer unless with mods. Onward, with a full team, you go through, you clear buildings. It's like a tactical shooter. It's very fun. Blade and Sorcery is also incredible. I love that. But yeah, those are my two favorite VR games other than Rec Room. The next question is, if Rec Room didn't exist, what content would I make? Most likely, I'd probably still be making like oh Minecraft God. content or something. Oh. Maybe I would be making VR content because I didn't get a VR just for Rec Room. It's just something I kind of installed and then ended up really liking. Who knows, I could have turned out with like a huge gorilla tag creator, I don't know. Next question is, do I have siblings? I actually do have a sibling. I have one brother. He's been on my channel before. I made a video, it'll be right up here, where I basically played with him on Rec Room and showed him around and how to play the game. It was a pretty funny video, so check it out. Next question is from my friend Noob. He basically asked, did I ever feel like quitting YouTube or like I wouldn't be a good YouTuber? Not entirely. I haven't really felt like quitting. Sometimes I've wanted to take a break, but not really. I never wanted to quit. I love YouTube. It's my main favorite hobby. And I love meeting you guys all in live streams and stuff like that. So yeah, I, I never have felt like quitting yet. Hopefully, never. Next question is from my friend Aiden, or Himi. And why did I start making horror content? Literally because it did well, and because I saw his channel did well with horror content. Like, before I met him, I watched some of his videos to try to find good horror games. Because I posted one horror video and it popped off. Right now it's at like 98,000 views, which is crazy. And so I just kept posting horror content. But I would like to start posting kind of more normal Rec Room content. So if you guys would like that, please let me know in the description. Bro, what? what? In the comments down below. Next question is an insanely intelligent question. One of the most intelligent questions I have heard in my entire being. What color are your socks? Man, I'm dead. Well, as you can see, I don't have legs, meaning I don't have feet. Meaning, I don't have sock. So yeah, thank you Zia for that insane, intelligent question. Next is, will I play the I Expect You To Die series? Probably not on camera, only being the videos would just not do well. Especially since they're solo games, and I can't really make them that funny. And since they're kind of story based, I gotta leave in some of the kind of story parts of the game, meaning I can't really make it that fast paced and it would just not turn out a great video, but I do want to play them, just probably not on camera. Next question is, why did I start my YouTube channel? Mostly, it's a, it's a very good question, but mostly it's just I wanted to be like the YouTubers that I used to kind of watch. Like I was very, very, very young when I started my YouTube channel, I think I was like eight. So I used to watch YouTube all the time, and I just wanted to be a YouTuber. And I would post like Fortnite and Minecraft content, I know. But then nowadays I kind of take it more seriously, and I do genuinely want to try to grow my channel. 
Next question is an interesting one. When am I gonna do a face reveal? Most likely either never or in a very, very long time because I just don't want my face on YouTube that much. So yeah, most likely either it'll be a very, very, very long time before I do one or it'll just be never. Next question is what made me want to play Rec Room and then the second part of the question I already answered. What made me want to play Rec Room I guess was just like I played it before on screen mode and I did not like it. But then when I got my VR I kind of downloaded it and I tried it out. I still didn't like it that much. But eventually I started getting more into the community and like I started playing more of the RROs and stuff like that and I just ended up really liking it. And videos that I posted on Rec Room were doing really good. So I just started playing it a lot and I ended up loving it. So thank you guys so much for a thousand subscribers. Those are all the questions I think I got. Join the Discord server. Link is in the description. And I've been doing a few like a thousand subscriber live streams. I think those are over, but I'm still doing more live streams. So join. you can join in on those. And thank you so much for watching. And thank you for continuing to watch my channel. And next is 2K, which we might hit very soon because we're already at 1.6K. See you guys in the next video.